The YouTube meditation niche. In today's video, I'm going to explain why you should probably not start a YouTube meditation channel if you want to get yourself a play button like this in 2021 and beyond. So if you're interested in YouTube meditation videos and channels and you want to get success on YouTube, keep watching because this is going to be interesting. So the YouTube meditation niche is pretty much all over YouTube as of right now. If you search for meditation, you'll see that the highest viewed video has 274 million views. Now that is insane. However, you can see that the videos being posted and ranking on YouTube search are getting millions upon millions of views. We've got 2.2 million, we've got 4.2 million, 10 million, we've got 20K within two days, which is pretty decent, 2 million, we've got like 11 million, 1 million, you get the point. Meditation videos on YouTube are extremely popular and a lot of them are getting millions and millions of views, allowing these creators, if they're monetized, to make money by putting ads on these videos. However, is that gonna be a good method for you to make money with YouTube? So first of all, I do wanna show you that a lot of people are making videos about how to make money with meditation videos. So if I simply search for this, you'll come across a ton of videos from people explaining how you can make money by making these simple, simple um, meditation videos where you simply download a file, you use some background, some stock footage, you upload it and you're gonna make money on YouTube. In today's video, I wanna go into that and explain why in my opinion, it is probably not the best idea to go into the YouTube meditation niche as of right now and probably within the years to come as well. Let's dive into that. So once again, a lot of videos about how you can make money with YouTube meditation content or just like rain content or just uploading simple videos that would allow you to make a lot of money on YouTube. So in my opinion, that is not the case. Let me explain why. So this is probably the most sought after niche as of right now for people that want to make YouTube content without showing their face. So as of right now, this is extremely popular and these videos are getting a lot of views. And most of them are showing people how they can make money on YouTube without showing their face. And they'll then explain the YouTube meditation niche. However, there are a couple of pro problems with that. So first of all, if I just search for meditation, once again, you'll see all of these keywords, right? Meditation music, meditation music, relax mind body, um, for beginners, attraction, for sleep. Now it doesn't matter which keyword you search for, all of the videos will have a ton of views and there are thousands of people trying this specific niche. Now, normally I wouldn't say that there's gonna be a niche on YouTube that is um, saturated because in my opinion, you can always win on YouTube. If you make good content, use the right strategy, you're always gonna win on YouTube. And it's probably no different with the meditation niche. However, it is like displayed as an easy niche because you can just make some videos, upload them, put some background music on it, use some free stock footage, and that's it. That's how you can become a YouTuber and make a full-time income or just make a few K per month or whatever it is that the claims um, claim to be, right? However, like I just said, the competition is really huge. Like if you take a look at vidIQ, you'll see the competition is very high. There are channels out there with millions and millions of subscribers and views, and it's gonna be really hard for someone that is just getting started that doesn't really know how YouTube works to get into this niche and to actually succeed. There are so many people doing this as of right now. So in my opinion, your time and your skills are gonna be more valuable in other niches because if you're gonna go into this niche, it's extremely popular, extremely saturated, and it's hard to break in because all of these channels already have a couple million subscribers and a couple million views on average per video. So that is reason number one. Now reason number two is even more important and that is demonetization. So on YouTube, you can make money by putting ads on the videos. This video has ads, which means that I'm making money. However, you can do that with any video as long as you're in a YouTube partner program. How do you get into the YouTube partner program? You need a thousand subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time. After that, you can apply. You then need to get approved by a human review on YouTube's end. However, if you don't um, like fit within that program, they're not gonna accept you. And YouTube meditation channels are often seen as reused content or just fabricated content that is being reused over and over again. Because if you think about it, it's just an audio track with a random picture or 
random like stock video footage but it's not like an actual human being that's creating content now some of the people doing this are indeed showing their face they're creating their content themselves they're going outside they're filming these which means that it's their property but a lot of channels are just downloading an image from a free stock footage website they then go ahead and use some random audio and that is it that's the video they then just pretty much do that over and over again and that is not allowed on youtube so this is one of these examples is from july 2019 but it's still happening as of today this channel got demonetized so he says relaxing videos have come to an end demonetization number two so in this video he's pretty much explaining what happened he got demonetized because he's making content that doesn't really fit within the youtube guidelines it does i mean it, it does fit within the guidelines but within the youtube partner program uh, guidelines so as you guys can see within the comments there are also more people that are explaining that this happened to them as well so for this channel it happened twice you just want to so you can just see a lot of people complaining about this happening to them and also just the audience reacting to what happened to this guy however that is point number two why you should in my opinion not start a youtube meditation channel so when doing youtube channels i mainly want to focus and i believe that that's the goal for you as well um on channels and content that's going to bring in money over the next few years or at least is able to build a stable income however with a channel like this you're constantly going to have to worry about getting demonetized because some of these channels are not following the guidelines. They're simply using a random video and then a random picture, or I mean a random video and a random audio track, meaning that it probably doesn't fit within the YouTube Partner Program guidelines. Now, if you already have a monetized channel, that is gonna be better than starting a new one. Let me explain why. So when you've got a new channel, you do need to get that to that 1K and 4K, and then you need to get approved into the YouTube Partner Program, and that is where the issue is. However, if you already have a channel that is monetized, you could get away with this, and the only issue that might happen is that you're gonna get demonetized. But when starting a new channel, you have to get monetized first, which is extremely hard within this niche, because first of all, you do need to get to 4K and 1K, which should be doable if you're good enough. However, the next issue is actually getting approved in 2021 with a channel like this. And that is honestly probably not gonna happen. So that is why I personally would not start and never start a YouTube meditation channel. First of all, you're probably not gonna get accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. It's dangerous with YouTube demonetization. And because of that, it is, in my opinion, not really sustainable or you're always going to have to worry about getting demonetized. However, all of that is just my personal opinion, so don't take these as facts. However, this is my personal opinion, like I just said, and that is why I would not start a YouTube meditation channel. However, if you want to see more about my YouTube channels and some videos about how I got this YouTube play button, then I've got another one right there. I'm not sure if you can see that on camera, but I have uh, two play buttons right now. Hopefully, this channel will get there as well with your help. Please subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos about topics like these. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below, and then I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.